So, yeah, Michael's been talking about the uh, behind the scenes stuff. And all the voices and stuff that goes on. Hey, speaking of voices. Yeah. You want to take a call? Well, sure. I'll take a call. Line two? Yep, line two. Hello, caller. Welcome to Buju Nana Buju. You're on the air. Hey, you Nana Buju. It's me, Sly Stallone. Hey, Rocky. Sweetie, it's Rocky. Well, hey there, Rocky. Hey, yo, you can call me Sly. Oh, sorry, Sly. Hey, how you doing, Natasha? I'm doing great. How are you? Hey, you know, I'm not too bad, not too bad. How about you, Nana Buju? You doing all right? Hey, I, you know, I'll be honest with you, Sly. Hey, what's the matter? You tell the Italian style in your problems. Well... I don't understand it. The live stream show has just bit the dust. For whatever reason, I don't know what we did. I suspect Michael did something not on purpose. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I did something stupid, but I don't know what. Or the bad spirits, because we also lost our uh, Facebook page. That's half of it. Yeah, we had, uh, you know, thousands of followers that don't see the videos anymore. That's probably half of it. But I've been feeling kind of down, you know, because uh, our show is not doing so well. The people, people have stopped watching. You know, we'll, we'll do a video and I'll, I'll put it up on Facebook and on YouTube and that. And we'll get like eight people. I'm like, <laughs> okay. Uh, it's been four years of this. We can't just keep doing a show for eight people when YouTube's got the the potential for, uh, you know, unlimited. It's basically just a crapshoot. Here's a TV show. You want, you know. And for a while there, for four years, we saw our show steadily grow in popularity. Until we could kind of count on every show having about 100 viewers. Every day. Just, you know, there'd be 30 to 40 people with us live. And then by the next time we came on, there'd be another 30, 40 people watched out in YouTube land. And I don't know if, uh, if we offended somebody and the algorithms by talking about making fun of, you know, Bruce Jenner. That's Caitlin. I mean, Caitlin. Yeah, I don't know. You, you made fun of the vaccination, too. Yeah, I made fun of that. I mean, but it didn't seem to happen then. It seemed to happen just this summer, this last spring. The Facebook page went down, and I couldn't get back on. Uh, Michael fell apart, Natasha. I don't know. Hey, listen, Nana Buju. I'm going to tell you something you already know. What's that? Life, it ain't all sunshine and roses. Yeah, I know. I don't care how tough you are. Me, you, nobody's going to hit harder than life. Yeah? Yeah. But it ain't about how hard you can hit. It's about whether or not you can take the hits and keep moving forward. Really? You've got to be able to take the hits or keep moving forward. You know, you can't be going around blaming other people for your problems, pointing your finger at Facebook, pointing your finger at YouTube, pointing your finger at the Bougie crew. That's loser talk! And that ain't you! You're better than that! <laughs> yeah, you're right. You know, you gotta pick yourself up. You know why I tell you this? Why? Because that's how winning's done. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Whatever, sometimes this happens. You know... I remember there was a time I had to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Apollo Creed. Yeah? And, you know, it wasn't about whether or not I won. I'm going to tell you something. You already know. What's that? The first time I fought Apollo Creed, I lost. I tried my best. I tried my hardest. And I fought my heart out. But in the end, I, lo I lost. You know, he won the big match. I lost. But I didn't lose because I kept moving forward. Yeah, no kidding, huh? You gotta keep moving forward. So then I made another, I made a, 
what they call that, the sequel, and then I made Rocky three, and then I had to fight a Russian, and then I had to bury my wife, and then bury my trainer, and then bury Clubber Lang, or whoever, and then pretty soon, I, you know, everybody died. So I had to uh, keep moving forward. And now my kids, now the Apollo Creed's kids in Rocky, I don't know what's going on anymore. <laughs> but the important thing to remember is you kept moving forward. Yeah, man. Yeah, that is why I love that movie. Oh, it's really pretty out here. Yeah, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I better keep my eyes on the road. The roads, whoa, whoa. The roads are kind of slick. <laughs> I'll say. I don't want to be running up that road. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to be sliding around that hill. <laughs> yeah. It doesn't hurt me.
Look out, sweetie. <laughs> I think I see a light at the end of the tunnel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I see the light at the end of the oh, tunnel. Here it comes. We're going to make it after all. <laughs> I was wondering. Oh, uh. <laughs> uh. And if only could. Want to play a card ga a car game or something? <laughs> okay, <laughs> maybe really. I'll maybe I'll just watch the road. <laughs> oh, it's really pretty on here. Though. Yeah, no. Beautiful. We could do a show just from the just from the car. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> <laughs>